this way. All right, we are here with uh, Chef Steve Jason, one of the executive corporate executive chefs here at Universal, and of course we are in Moe's Tavern. Yes. Tell us how this all came about. Well, <laughs> okay. how all the Simpsons came about, that started with our creative department and working with the Simpsons and creating the whole idea of developing this. Obviously, we opened up the original Simpsons ride a little bit, uh, probably about a year and a half ago or so, but we wanted to bring the whole thing all the way and create all the Springfield and all of the fun things that kind of went along with it that you read about in the, if you would look into the books or just watch the program. So, uh, uh, you know, Moe's Tavern and Fast Food Alley with Lisa's Healthy Corner and the Frying Dutchman and the Krusty Burger and Cletus's Chicken and Luigi's Pizza all right out of the show and trust, tried to do a lot of things in there that were representative of everything that they were eating uh, in the, on the television show or in the books and uh, create some fun stuff for everybody to try. And everything is just so rich and full of flavor. I mean, it, you didn't just take a regular burger and slap the Simpsons name on it. You actually, you've been saying it a lot, it's silly and sloppy like Homer. Yeah. But the other thing that it is like Homer is Homer represents the typical all-American guy. Yeah, exactly. And that, that's exactly what you did with the with the burger. I mean, it's really a lot of good flavors. Yeah, that, you know, that. of course, anything, I'm a chef. And I'm not going to make anything that I don't think doesn't taste good or doesn't taste spectacular for that matter. I right. mean, and we wanted the food in here to be unique, as did the writers and Matt and the rest of everybody um, with, with The Simpsons. They wanted it to be unique. So we looked at that and we said, what can we do to make it unique, to give it its little twist, but at the same time, give those guests a great meal. And henceforth, we came up with unique sauces for the crusty burger, made it a little sloppy, a fresh cooked burger right there in front of the guests, baked the rolls in our production kitchen with a special recipe that we use only for this location, okay? Created everything like these cupcakes that you can only get here in this location, the Lard Lad donuts that'll be in which here, are and at Lard Lads, which will open shortly. And, uh, and, you know, just down the line, a nice vegetarian pizza with a whole wheat crust and, and the, all the fish in the frying Dutchman, all fresh, flown in. You know, I've been flying in fresh. I, I've never bought frozen fish here ever, and I don't plan on it. Even for my employee feeding, I feed my employees fresh fish. I don't, I, fry, I cut all fresh vegetables. Very few, that if you went to my employee feeding area, you may see a few sauteed peas and pearl onions or something like that. I buy those frozen. But I can put some nice flavors on them, I can cook them quickly, and I give them a good product. But in here, at the Simpsons, we wanted everything, like the curly fries with the, with the Krusty Burger right. was so appropriate because they're kind of silly and fun. You know, the kids pick them up and hold them and they kind of stretch out and play like an accordion. <laughs> So, you know, that's what well, you could just see. I could just see Homer, you know, like taking curly fries and kind of playing with them, you know, oh, or taking tater tots and tossing them up, or throwing them across the bar to somebody. Well, so. one more thing, and we'll let you go real quick. Um, the maple mayonnaise. Yeah. I'm not a fan of mayonnaise at all. I hate mayonnaise with a passion. I would eat that stuff off a of bottle. Uh. It's amazing. <laughs> it really that's is amazing. Great. Well, you know, you think about a chicken sandwich. And you think about waffles, and what two things do you think about? I mean, I think about mayonnaise and maple syrup. So we put them together, a few other little ingredients in there, and came up with a really neat sauce to just make that sandwich a little sloppy and silly, but really good tasting. All right. Yeah. Thank you so much for you your time. It. All right. My